At the beginning of the episode, we see this book, it's The Order, and we see Bernard reading from it. And it really gave me this feeling like, what if big housekeeping took ran society, <laughs> like took control, like in the event of a failed cleaning, prepared for war, like, like super, super uptight about their society, about how they see things. But joke aside, I didn't understand why was it so important? Like, why is it so bad if someone does not clean? Well, okay, first thing, if a public restroom in the silo wasn't cleaned for an extended period of time, Oh boy, that's, that's time. Yeah. That's yeah. so. First off, biohazard, and yeah. since the down deep people are doing the cleaning, that is fighting. Oh, that's, that's a sign a that call. they are not willing to do their part, right? Because they're be a cleaning strike. The, the toilets, I'm cleaning the toilets. Mm. So the public toilets, or even the personal toilets, are just getting, you know, encrusted. Oh, crust. Oh, word <laughs> choice. But yeah. I mean, actually, that could be a form of rebellion. A janitor strike in the silo would be a serious concern. I mean, I mean, health hazard, right? Because then people's right. apartments start getting bacteria and yeah, health hazard. Right. And you've got stuff to maintain, like mm. machinery and stuff that needs to stay clean all the time. Otherwise, it's going to break down. It's wicked clean. Yeah. But this isn't your question. Your question is the cleaning <laughs> on the outside. Right. On the lens. Why is that so like, bad? What, what does that mean? Why is it so bad? So I don't understand it. And the reason I don't understand it is if a person goes out there and sees that it's green, okay, then they want to clean the lens mm -hmm. to show everybody in the cafeteria that it's green outside. However, that person has seen the camera feed in the cafeteria for years. And they've right. seen it after post-cleaning, it's clear. And before cleaning, it's smudgy. Mm -hmm. But it's not like the cleaning was like, oh, I see a little bit of green poking through. No, it's That's just, right. It was just a smudgy desolate desolation, and when after cleaning, it was a clear desolation. Right. So the only conclusion is it must be a doctored feed. So cleaning isn't going to yeah. help, right? That's right. Yeah, that's right. Because if it's if it was genuinely just smudgy lens, it wouldn't change the color of the landscape from dead stuff like gray and brown into green and full of life. Yeah, I don't. I don't get it. I don't get it what, they, what they're thinking. If you had a full like forest scene, and you started smudging the lens in real life, it would be hard to smudge it in such a way that it looked like brown <laughs> landscape with smudges. It'd be yeah, really like, hard. You, you see like like a bald eagle, and you smudge it, and like now it's a skeleton. <laughs> now it's just yeah. You have like a green tree, and you like just smudge the leaves, so now it's like a desolate dead tree, like. You're going to so, have green poking through. Ugh. So if someone does not clean, because they're like, what's the point? It's going to be I, the camera feed looks dirty and dead anyway. If they don't clean, why is that so bad? Like, what is what is that? Why, what's the big deal? Yeah. So from the perspective of the people in the cafeteria, if a person doesn't clean, it's desolate outside. If a person does clean, it's now desolate outside, a little bit crisper. Yeah. What's the, but, yeah why is that going to why is that going to lead to an uprising? I don't get it. Right. It doesn't affect my view of what's going on outside. Either yep. way. Yeah, I don't get it. I don't understand don't what... Is there something we're missing about cleaning? Let us know. I don't get it. It would be different if the person that went outside was like, everything, like everything out here, good. Right? That's like a clear message of everyone should try to rush the door and get out here. But there's no sign that cleaning... Cleaning doesn't mean to the people inside the silo that it's good outside, come outside. Right. I mean, I guess easy things to do would be create your own sign language with yeah. your friends. And you could be like, this means green. This means bad. This means I'm not sure. This means yeah. something, you know. Yeah. And you could come up with a sign language idea and then you could communicate inward. But cleaning the lens. How is that enough of a communication to be like, time to revolt? Like, I don't get it. Yeah. I don't get it. Plus, somebody's going out there to die. They're like, I'm supposed to clean it. But they're so like up in their head about dying that mm -hmm. they forget. Like it could, it could be absent-minded because they're in yeah. a, a high adrenaline mode. Gosh, and people think that Juliet walked over the hill and that means that she's alive. But as far as they would all know, she went out there to die. Right. Like, and just what does it matter got... if she walked a little bit further away to die? Right. She went out I, to I would probably, yeah, I would conclude that she made it a little bit further than the other people, but is dead. Right. Because... It's not I like mean, she's I... like doing, she's not like she's doing burpees out there. Like <laughs> she's just she's <laughs> weird. Right. If now she came back up over the hill. A little, little teaser, like, hey, I'm still here. Hey, like, hey, 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 what's up? Hey. Is that graffiti started yet? Yeah. 
<laughs> Weird. <laughs>